This is the story of Teddy Bear. Teddy Bear worked at King's Church cleaning the toilets. He decided he would put £10 in the offering. And what came out when the offering was counted? £10! Teddy wondered if there was any better way of giving to King's. Some of his friends told him he had to use one of the envelopes while giving. So the next week, Teddy bought £10 in an envelope and put that in the offering bucket. Teddy was sad to see that even when he gave using his envelope, only £10 came out of the offering bucket. What could he be doing wrong, he thought. And then another of his friends said he had to use a gift aid envelope. So the next week, Teddy put his £10 in a gift aid envelope. Teddy was so sad to see that despite using a gift aid envelope, only £10 came out of the offering bucket yet again. Can you see what he did wrong? That's right, he didn't fill out any of the information on the gift aid envelope. The next week, Teddy was sure he got it right. He filled in the gift aid envelope and put his £10 in it. Teddy was elated to see that after he'd put his £10 in a properly filled out gift aid envelope, out came his original £10 and another £2.80 from the offering bucket. Teddy was so pleased to find that giving by gift aid was such a simple process. All he had to do now was fill out a gift aid declaration form. And even when he could give more money, the church could get another 28p for every pound he gave. If you're a UK taxpayer, you can use one of the gift aid envelopes too. On the left hand side, add your name, the date you're giving and the amount. And if there's any particular events or missions you'd like to give to, specify that there too. All you need to do on the right hand side is tick the relevant box, write your address if you haven't given a gift aid declaration before, and sign your name. Teddy will thank you for doing this, as it means he can carry on cleaning the toilets at King's Church. Goodbye!